Toys and Game, Transformer Collector and Festival and Dealer. Toys and Game, welcome to Transformer G1 Octane Review. This is, uh, this is, this one came out in 1986. Uh, it's a Decepticon Triple Changer. Obviously, I only just have two right here. I have one in the truck mode and also one in the robot mode. So we'll go and take a look at this. So here we are, we have the truck mode right here. Um, obviously, you know, this is the gas tank right here. So if, if this gets hit by a bullet or, or something, then this whole thing will explode right here. So we took a look on the front. Um, I don't know, the front doesn't look that attractive. Um, unfortunately, the arms is loose right here though. But I mean, obviously this is not because it'd be the arm because this is in the truck mode right here. But other than that, I mean, they got wheels on the bottom. It definitely can do a little sliding. Okay, so let's go ahead and transform this into, what did you say? Let's transform into um, the plane for so. So for the plane, um, you got to take off this, uh, this tank truck cover. And then we'll go ahead and move this out right here. And then on the other side, we'll move this out. And it's true, uh, snap on right here. There, there you go. And move this arm down the way here. Move these wings out. And this one, we'll put it in place. This will form the head of the plane here. And then we'll go the wings. We'll go this way. And I gotta move these arm down. So we have enough space with the wings right here. And for the arm, I actually have a little groove right here though, but you can put it right here, and for example, on this side right here. Okay, so we have the plane though, right here. Passenger airplane. Unfortunately, I don't have the um, the tail wings right here, and I don't have the box or the instruction manual with me either though. The only problem I don't like about this is that they have the wheels on top. Uh, I mean, the wheel should be on the bottom right here, though. So, this, I mean, we have designed this. This should have came up with a better idea. And also, another wheel on top right here, though. The wheel should be on the bottom somehow. So, here we are. We have the, um, the plane right here. And, all right, so let's transform him into the robot mode here. So, for the robot, uh, we got to move this back in here. And... Back in here, and back in here, right here, and then this will become the leg or the, or the feet. And move it back out, and these actually separate a little bit there, that way um, it won't collapse. There you go, and then for this right here, we'll have to push this down, and there you go. You got the head right here on top, and for the hand, you gotta rotate this right here. You gotta rotate this all the way over here. So you can move the arms out. And we'll uh, get stuck right here somehow. Let that out a little bit and then we'll just, there we go. Now we should be able to do it. And then we we'll have to move his arms up a little bit and move the wings out a little bit. There you go. And now we're gonna move his arm down. Move him back out here. Okay. Now we have him in the robot mode here. So for this, for this um, tanker tank truck cover, what you can do is you can attach it right here and we'll protect as a shield. Use a shield right here. And then, and then we'll have, um, and then you can put a gun right here, so I have the gun on this side. The only problem with this is that the, the weight on top is so much, it, it doesn't really hold itself, so you have to be careful. There you go. Oh, it's good. Now we have two of them in the robot mode here. All right, so I just need one more though. So I'm gonna have one robot mole, uh, one airplane mole, and one in the um, tank and truck mole. All right, there you go. There you have it. 
All right. Thank you for watching, everyone. If you enjoyed the content, please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you next week. Bye.